our lives are always changing and often in unexpected ways, but we are able to adapt and move on relatively easily. That's not always the case for our canine companions, and it's an important factor to consider, especially if your living or family situation tends to change often. Today, we're going to look at how adaptable the bull mastiff is and see how well they might handle your life changes. Welcome back to the Bull Mastiff channel. If this is your first time here, my name's Charlie and I'm a certified canine leader here at FenrirCanineLeaders.com. This channel is dedicated to helping you learn everything you could possibly want to know about the Bull Mastiff, then how to become high level canine leaders that can raise the perfect Bull Mastiff. So if you're a lifelong lover thinking about getting one or just started your journey with your new Bull Mastiff, then this is the channel for you. So make sure you hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell so you never miss a future Bull Mastiff video. So let's dive into today's video and we'll take a look at the adaptability of this huge breed. Our canine companions have little say in some of the changes that happen in our life, like having a baby, moving to a new home or taking a job with longer working hours. We should, of course, consider the needs of our canines when making decisions that will impact them. But we're often put in those same situations at a moment's notice too. So how adaptable is the bull mastiff when it comes to changes in our lives? Let's find out. We'll dive right in and look at a key factor in adaptability, energy. The bull mastiff reaches maturity around three years of age and with their puppy and teenage years coming to a close, their energy level drops a bit. They're generally a pretty low energy breed anyway, but they will range closer to moderate energy for their first three years of their life. They need an hour or so of exercise every day, so having a large fenced area, a larger home, is ideal. Should your home and yard decrease in size, then you're going to have to be more dedicated to exercising them, but they will adjust to smaller living remarkably well for their size. This could mean longer walks around the neighbourhood or easy brain games in the home, but you'll genuinely find the bull massive to be quite happy as long as they're with you and their family. Hey guys, sorry to interrupt the video. I just wanted to quickly let you know, if you didn't know already, I have a completely free course on the principles of canine behaviour. As a canine behaviourist, I've put this together with my years of experience, skill set and knowledge to help you understand all the areas of canine behaviour that are important for you to be become a high level canine leader and then you can fix your dog's problem behaviors at home or maybe take the first steps into working with dogs with problem behaviors. So again, if you wanna check out that course, it's completely free of charge. The principles of canine behavior, there'll be a link down in the description box below and I can't wait to see you over on that course. The Bull Mastiff is fairly trainable and willing to please their calm, consistent leader, which can come in handy when their life is uprooted. Obedience work is a great way to focus their mind and energy in new places where they need to ignore the new distractions. But they aren't overachievers in this area. They likely find a comfy spot with a view and carefully watch their new surroundings whilst keeping an eye on their family. Remember, your bull mastiff ancestors were bred to be estate guardians, so they prefer situations that are familiar, so they can easily spot anything amiss. Keeping their routines as familiar as possible will help to transition them into their new life, whether that be a new home, a new baby, or less time with you. The bull mastiff is a devoted family canine that thrives when somebody is with them, but they're genuinely quite comfortable being alone too. It is still crucial that you work on their confidence alone from an early age and build up the time that they're left alone rather than just jumping in. Bull Mastiffs are capable of destroying their kennel, chewing any number of things and other destructive behaviours when they aren't trained to accept being alone. Moderate exercise, quality bonding and crate training are going to be key in keeping your Bull Mastiff from developing separation anxiety. Since you never know when you might suddenly start working more or be home later, it's crucial that you teach this acceptance early on and keep training maintained throughout the life of your bull mastiff. It will make many life changes easier for both your canine and for you to adapt to at a moment's notice. Bull mastiffs are incredibly devoted and affectionate with their family, so changes in their life that result in less time with you or the rest of the family are going to be the hardest for them to adjust to. If you've taken a job with longer hours and don't have a family member that can be there, you'll need to work harder when exercising and bonding with them in the morning and evening. 
If you or someone your bull mastiff trust can be there for an hour or two in the middle of the day to give them some attention, then they'll adapt so much more easily. As with most things, it's easiest to make the adjustments in stages if possible and get creative when making accommodations if it's not. Keep in mind that if you know a life change will directly impact the amount of time you can spend with your bum mastiff and know that it's coming, start adjusting to the new routine as early as possible. Overall, the bull mastiff is one of the most adaptable large dog breeds out there, but you'll still want to train them in and for a variety of situations since it's impossible to know what changes your experience in your life. Their guarding instincts and sheer size are going to be two of your biggest factors when considering the overhaul adaptability of the bull mastiff. So start working on those early and then often throughout their lives to make changes as easy on them as for you as possible. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If so, make sure you hit that like button and get involved down in the comment section below. And don't forget, if you are new here, to make sure you subscribe. We have two dedicated bull master videos coming here every every single week. So I can't wait to talk to you again on the next episode of the Femme Rebel Mastiff Show.